go bummer.
awards for the A3 boys. In fourth place, Kamiai with 40 points.
and your 1988 state champions from Jerome with a new state record of 3 minutes 26.72 seconds. Paul Hancock, Aaron Meyer, Doug Stuber, and John Sorley.
Bishop Kelly fifth, Marsh Valley sixth, Wood River seventh, and Emmett. Tigers, the boys team once again, kings of the hill. The Tigers started the day behind the field, but made quick strides. Aaron Meyer picks up points in the hurdles, and the 4x200 relay team right here tore up the track as they came from just behind on their way to a gold medal. Doug Stuhlberg with a great anchor leg there. Randy Lance will take third in the 800, and John Gorley comes out of the block slow and loses to Snake River's Mark Lynn in the 100. Undaunted, the Tigers will come back as uh, Gurley will be given the lead 
in the 4 by 100 relay as Jerome got out to a great start here, and they kept pouring it on, and any time you give Gourley a lead and he's only got 100 meters to run, forget it. He blows the field away, and here come the Tigers. At this point, the girls weren't doing too bad either. And Jerome just getting the points here and there when they need them and getting all those victories, especially in the relay races. And back to the boys' 200, and Gourley, running strong, will win by half a second. The loss in the 100 must have really fired him up because he really smoked the field and everything else he ran the rest of the day. More points in the 1600 before the girls and boys will take the mile relay. And the win will seal the state title for the boys who, uh, yeah, where's that second place team? They were way behind Jerome. They waited until the running to get the job done, something Coach Tim Dunn knew his kids could do. Dunn knew his kids could do. Uh, sometimes you, you go into the state a little bit apprehensive, uh, and the thing that this may be the sweetest of all of our championships because of the adversity we had uh, early in the season with our distance runners, uh, Matt Dixon and Stan Ness getting hurt, and then Gorley and Stuhlberg pulling, and uh, I think kind of the ad adversity pulled them together, and uh, I'm really going to miss that group of seniors. Uh, they showed a lot of heart today. They were, they were down, they were behind, but uh, when it counted, they came through. Yeah, you know, we kind of like to show off on the track. We don't do much in the field. And uh, when the running finals come down, you know, we get pretty serious. And the kids uh, came to state to win uh, because of the way they acted in the motel room last night and on the bus ride and that kind of thing. Okay, what that was left was the ceremonial dunking of the coach then after winning a state championship. And so there they do it. Again, Jerome wins it after coming from behind, as you see the rest of them. And in the girls... In